Let's get ready to rumble. What is up, Bulldog Nation? It's your boy, Sean Bulldog here. And today, today I'm going over some life lessons all teens must follow. If that sounds interesting, let's hop into it. So number one, which is stop caring about passion. Care about making money. Stop caring about passion and care about making money. Yes, it's always good to have a passion, whether it's painting or I don't know. Um, what's a passion? Um, making bracelets or... Uh, my mind's blank. Different dip hobbies can be a passion. If you... If you care so much about that passion, maybe instead of doing it for fun, maybe you can use that passion, whatever, whatever it may be, you know, painting or making bracelets or something like that, start making money, sell it on Etsy or sell it on, I don't know, Facebook Marketplace sites that you can make money make it make it a pat you can also you can your hobby can be a passion that you love doing but your passion you can also make money while still um loving your passion so if you have a passion if you have a hobby and you like it it's a passion you love doing it whether it's making bracelets um painting whatever like i said start go online facebook marketplace etsy and sell your stuff start making that money making that dough you already know number two which is take responsibility for everything at People do not take responsibility for their actions. I'm not saying everybody. I'm not saying everybody um, doesn't take responsibility for their actions or for everything. But if you if you did something, if you did something, take responsibility f for your actions or what you did. That's technically the same thing. But or what you said. Take responsibility for your actions. Take responsibility for what you did, what you said. Taking responsibility for whatever you did. It, it makes you better as a person, as a human being, because it shows that you have class. It shows that you... You... What's the word I want to use? You know when you're wrong. Is. Guess what I'm trying to say here. You know you're wrong. Take responsibility. Don't try to blame on somebody else. Don't try to blame on somebody else. If you did it. If you said it. Take responsibility for your actions. For what you said. And not a lot of teens do that. Make yourself that one in a hundred. Number three, which is your grooming is more important than your style. I'm not saying style, your style is important. It is, but your grooming is a little bit more important. Whether that's your beard, your chest, shaving in general. Just cleaning yourself up can go a long way. It makes you look better. It makes you have a better appearance. Why would you not want to look better, smell better? Your grooming is, the, is more important than... Your style. 
like I said before, your style is important, but it's not as important as smelling good and looking good. Your grooming is a little bit more important, which means shower every day. Groom if need be, as far as like beard and chest and shaving in general. That means putting deodorant on every day. I know I put deodorant on every day. Uh, I put cologne on every day. Make your, make your grooming, have a grooming routine. Have a grooming routine. Do something that you do every day. Set your gr grooming routine. Have, have a constant routine, a grooming routine. Put deodorant on, putting cologne on, you know, touching up your your beard and chest and stuff like that. Have have a have a grooming routine and knowing that you look good, you're gonna because you look good, you're gonna feel good, you're gonna look good, and you're gonna smell good. And you're also gonna look more attractive, so what can I say? Number four, which is you gotta fail more. You gotta fail more. And a lot of teens don't like failing. They always strive to, um, you know, complete and do things. But in reality, in life, we all fail. We all fail. And that's just life. You got to fail more. Because if you fail more, then you, um, you look back on your failures and you try not to repeat those failures again. Makes you a better person. Makes you, makes you a better character. If you know what I mean. You got to fail more. To be better. To be a better you. To learn from your mistakes. And number five. The fifth and final thing. Which is stay in great shape. Again going back to the temple. Your body is a temple. The way you treat your temple. Is going to affect. How your body looks. If you. If you eat right, you know, you know, you stay in shape, you know, you go to the gym, you know, you eat healthy, your temple is going to look fantastic. But if you're going to eat like shit and, you know, not exercise and keep your body moving, obviously your body, is, you're going to grow a belly and it's not going to be good for you. And it also isn't attractive. I mean, maybe it is. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know if if uh, bellies are the thing nowadays. I don't know. Maybe it is. I don't know. But, like I said before, your body's a temple, and the way you treat your temple is the way your temple is going to look. That's all I can say to that. And that's going to wrap up today's video, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to drop a big fat like on this video. Helps me, helps the channel. You know the drill. If you are new, welcome. My name is Sean Bullock. I am so blessed and grateful that you are part of the Sean Bullock family. Hit the subscribe button if you are new. And if you haven't already, go hit that notification bell so you never miss an upload because I post every Monday, every Thursday. You don't want to miss them because they are absolute bangers. Or try to make them as bangers as possible. And uh, yeah. If you guys have any comments, concerns about me or the channel or any other video ideas that I should do in the near future, let me know down in the comment section below. If you guys haven't already, go check a follow on my social media. That'll be all in the description below. And uh, yeah, like, subscribe, comment, post vacation bill, post every Monday, every Thursday. Description, comment section, all that good stuff. And yeah, as always, guys, stay resilient, stay positive. Make your pain inspiration. Till next time, it's your boy Sean Boydicare. Peace.